New at six, students at Virginia Wesleyan University are banding together to raise awareness about hunger and homelessness. They're building makeshift shelters and spending the night in them to experience what it's like to be unhoused. Dana Smith spoke with the organizer about what he hopes his fellow students learn from the experience. It's about highlighting an issue affecting scores of people across the country and Hampton Roads. We tend to portray homelessness as an issue of personal responsibility, but the truth is, is that a lot of this is out of people's control. Aiden Foley is a freshman at Virginia Wesleyan University and the president of the group Students Against Continuous Homelessness. He's also the organizer of an event called Shackathon. Uh, basically, the Shackathon is a cardboard box sleep out. The two night, three day event is an effort to raise awareness about homelessness. We've got a handful of teams of about five people that are each going to construct their own shack. And then we're requiring that we have at least one member sleep out for the night. The initiative also features presentations and guest speakers from Virginia Beach Housing, REACH, and the Judeo-Christian Outreach Center. Foley said he wants to start a conversation and inspire people to help those who need it most. Uh, for people like you and I that have always spent our nights indoors, it's hard to imagine a night outside that isn't camping. But the truth is, is that for these people, this is their every day. The last time the university hosted Shackathon was back in 2017. Foley said he wanted to bring it back. He said by better understanding homelessness, he hopes more people might be inspired to advocate for better resources for people who are unhoused. Policies that are progressive in nature that help to fight homelessness by asking the question of not how do we get people back into houses and how do we keep people in their houses. Dana Smith, 13 News Now. Students are building their shacks today and will sleep on the university's lawn tonight and tomorrow night.